Listen, your uh, your solo record from 1989 one has some great melodic tunes such as I'll Never Hide My Love Again and I Can't Wait and a range of guests, uh, Doug Aldrich, Red Beach, and Mark Slaughter. What are your memories of, of making that record, your first solo album? Oh, yeah, well, I was kicked out from Loudness, 1980-something, mm. end of the 80s. So, um, well... I lost everything then, you know, but uh, one Japanese record company asked me if I want to make a solo album. And then, yeah, let's do it. And, um, well, you know, I wanted to play with, you know, like a like a great guitar player, uh, Alderich, and, uh, you know, guitar player from, uh, uh, I forgot everything. <laughs> I'm Red, too Red old Beach? To remember. Red Beach? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Winger. Uh, Red Beach and also... Play with the uh, horn sections from Tower Power, and uh, you know they they helped me uh, to make album a lot. So well, you are in the, stu- you, in the you, studio in LA. You you mentioned Tower of Power. You love. I know you're a fan of Soul and Otis Redding in particular. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm big fan of uh, Tower of Power all the time. I I was in a band when I was in a high school. I mean university. Mm. I was singer in a kind of cover band of Tower Power. So, uh, you know, I was a huge fan of Tower Power, so I was so happy to play with them in the studio in L.A. So, 